The Atkins photography business has deep roots in Australia. In 1936, William Atkins took over a photography business specializing in horse racing photography. And so began William G. Atkins Photography Limited, a company that still trades to this day. In the 1930s, any photographer in Australia had to be a generalist, doing their own processing, and Bill Atkins was no different, spending a great deal of skill and energy in delivering a reliable, quality product. Bill was a powerful individual, charming, spirited, and an excellent networker. His life was built around his customers, and he was rewarded with a formidable and focused photography business. The really innovative arm of the business sprouted when his wife Emily began hand coloring photographs, adding an element that was new and unique to the Australian photographic market. Business continued to grow when Bill's second son, John, left school at an early age to follow in his father's footsteps. Or perhaps it was to clean up after him. John inherited his father's unique blend of leadership and technical skill, and in the early 60s, with encouragement from his father, John set up full color processing and Atkins Adelaide modernized from black and white to color. The second generation continued to drive the Atkins business. New growth came from both John's careful customer focus and that of his wife, Marilyn, who developed many exciting new products and brought a corporate professional feel to the company, modernizing it from its strong owner-operator roots. In 1993, the third generation joined when their son, Paul, fresh out of a Bachelor of Business degree, began working for the company, and it was just in time to enter the digital world, a transition that Paul championed. Paul was quick to pick up the evolving technology and brought Adelaide into the digital age of photography. Atkins' entry into digital had two focuses, matching the quality of analog printing and educating their clients about how to use the new digital capabilities efficiently. In 2006, Paul became Managing Director, CEO, and constantly battled with changes as digital viewing and sharing reduced the demand for photo printing. They tried many new products, always promoting education and industry involvement, but nothing seemed to change the downward spiral. In 2008, they founded PicPress with three other partners attempting to move into the photo book business, but this too did not bring sufficient business growth. Then, in 2013, Paul adopted design-led innovation, and it has changed everything Atkins has done over the past year of implementation. Paul's wife, Kate, became Atkins' creative director, and the look and feel of Atkins has moved from corporate to a personal feel, putting family history up front. The focus on client-driven innovation led to changing product lines and offerings and a fundamental change to their marketing and service strategies. Atkins is focused on its clients more than ever. Every product and communication is being shaped to meet the most demanding market conditions in their history. They can turn on a dime, no longer longing for the past, tailoring the skills of their operations with how people are living their lives. For the first time since those heady days of the mid-80s, the lab, built by three generations, has turned around its sales, seen growth, and is ready to take the industry by storm. Congratulations to Paul Atkins from Atkins Photo Lab.